Hi again everyone, this is Chris from Elemental Play and today I'm going to open an import box I was able to get my hands on. Um, this is the uh, Caster Chronicles Magical Girl Rage Raising Project um, booster set. Uh, this one is not coming out in America, or at least it hasn't. Um, it's believed that this is going to be a licensing issue, so it probably won't be able to come out over here. Um, but I'm kind of a collector, so I wanted to see if I could get my hands on at least one box of it. And uh, I, I have to thank um, a buddy out in uh, Hong Kong who was able to ship one over to me. So um, I'm going to start cracking it open. Let's see what we've got in here. Uh, full disclosure, I can't read Japanese, so I won't be able to read the cards, uh, but we will take a look at them. At the very least, we'll be able to recognize the difference between casters, um, servants, things like that. So we'll see what that looks like. Now you can probably see that this box is a little small. Uh, that's because it is. It is, I wanna say six packs with only six cards in each one or something along those lines. So let's take a look. Uh, right in the top, we've got a promo card. That's cool. I actually didn't know that that was in there. Um, it's a neat little card, kind of a chibi character. Casters on the back. It's followed up by this uh, kind of slab of cardboard. I don't think that accomplishes much. And here's one of the, one of the packs for you. It's kind of cute. Let's see. I don't know if these have the, uh, the scannable codes in them. Yeah, it looks like they do. I'm a little curious if this will scan for me. It probably will, actually. So, got a spell of some sort. And there is a caster. Like I said, can't read any of it, so we're just going to take this at face value. Um, it's a little unfortunate that this set won't be able to come out in the U.S. I, I don't really like it when uh, when sets become, or games become, uh, different in different countries. I've always liked the idea that they can do an international competition and... and uh, send players from all over the world to meet up together to play but when when games become out of sync like this that no longer becomes an option so maybe at some point they'll be able to get the rights to it or they could do different art on them and just not brand it the same way so that at least the same cards exist um it might be tough with character names and whatnot but at least the options are out there so hopefully they can figure something out Ooh, I don't know what this is. That's a neat little card. I'll have to find out what that's about. I assume that's something special. There's our caster. I like that. That's neat. That's got this hollow um, duplicate of itself down here. I haven't seen the show, so I don't know the... Um, storylines or references that I assume exist on some of these. If anyone has seen the show, feel free to, to comment, let me know if it's something worth watching. Um, I'll pick up an anime here and there. I'm not a, not a big anime guy, but, um, you know, I like, I like some of the games and, um, these types of card games I think are really great. I love the Japanese card games. Um, so... I'm willing to learn the source material. I really like that caster. That's really cool. Um, the art's really nice on that. I'm always hoping for one of the really exciting rares in here, um, which I guess, you know, that technically could be. I, I really don't know what that is. I, I didn't know that they did anything like that in these, so.
That's a super rare. I guess it might be that all the casters are still super rare. Is that the case? Yeah, yeah, these are all labeled as super rare. For some reason, I was thinking some of the casters were rares, but I guess not. Hyper rares and, and ultra rares are the two other rarities. Oh, that's cute. I like that character. Zero, zero, though. I'd be curious what he does. That's our super rare in this set. All right. And that is all of them. So what did we have? One, two, three. We had six of, uh, of six. So yeah, 36 cards. Um, very small set, but kind of cute, fun to have around, and a uh, good addition to my collection. So there you have it. Um, Magical Girl Raising Project. Uh, if we could get the support from the Force of Will Company, maybe we could see more stuff like this over here. Um, but... In the meantime, uh, we've got another set coming out next month, uh, February, that is. And, uh, you know, hopefully we can keep this game going. It's really a lot of fun. If you haven't tried it, I definitely recommend it. Um, it's unique. It's, it's interesting. Um, and I'd like to see more like it. So um, be sure to follow, uh, share, like, all the internet stuff that everyone does. Um, Keep coming back for more videos. Check out my Twitter. Uh, I'll try and post these whenever they come up. Um, normally pretty quick about it. So be sure to keep an eye out. And uh, thank you for watching.